Okay. Now, in Acts chapter 10, verse 34, it says, Then Peter opened his mouth and said, Of a truth, I perceive that God is no respecter of persons. So now notice, he's not a respecter of persons. What does that mean? That means that God is not, well, he tells us in James not to be a respecter of persons, not to judge a person by what they wear or who they are or their social standing or anything else, that we are to be without partiality. Now, notice here, it says that God is no respecter of persons. Now, he is not a respecter of persons, all right? Now, we know this, but now notice, God is a respecter of faith. Do you get that? He's not a respecter of persons, but he is a respecter of faith. See, you can't, you'd have to be either one or the other. You can't be a respecter of persons and of faith, okay? But he's a respecter of faith. That means he's not looking at the person per se, but he's looking at the faith they put forth toward him. What is faith? Faith is knowing God, walking with God. It is trusting God. It's believing his word. That's kind of a simplified uh, definition of it. But faith is very simply just trusting God and trusting his word, believing what his word says. If the word says he's going to do it, he's going to do it. All right. I know it's not good English, but you get the point. All right. And if it says he's already done it, then guess what? He's already done it. That means he's not going to do it. It means he's already done it. And so you have to have faith in what the word says. You have to have faith in the fact that he said he's going to, or you have to have faith in the fact that he said he already has. And if you have faith, now think about this, if you have faith that he's going to do something when he's already done it, then you're not in faith. See, that, that's actually unbelief. Faith is believing exactly what God said. If you believe he said that by his stripes you were healed, then bless God, you were healed, right? It's a done deal. He's not going to heal you. He's already healed you. Now, you have to decide if and when you're going to receive it. 